You don't have to pass for a man to be a mercenary. I'm not passing as anything. In Kunadar, Krem would be an Akunathlak. That's what we call someone born one gender, but living like another. And Kunari don't treat those Akun people any differently than a real man. They are real men. Just like you are. Maybe your people aren't so bad after all. Don't get your hopes up, Krem. We still come down hard on the back talk. <laughs> anyway, here's the rest of the charges. Or what's left of the rest. A lot of them went looking for stronger drinks. We've got Rocky and Skinner there. And over there are Stitches, Dalish, <laughs> and Grim. Crazy bunch of assholes, but they're mine. So how'd you join the Chargers? Killed some people. Skinner didn't take kindly to nobles testing their new swords on the elves in her alienage. Bull took me in. Now I get paid to kill Shams. This is actually really good behavior for her. She's not marking her territory or anything. Grim, is it? Hmm. <clears throat> Grim doesn't talk much. I'm pretty sure he's the lost king of some small country, or chieftain. Something like that. Hmm. Why aren't you with your clan? Our keeper thought I should see the world a little. Dalish don't have Templars, so they can't have too many mages in a clan at once. Now, sir, you know I'm not a mage. That'd make me an apostate. You carry a staff, Dalish. It's a bow. A bow with a giant glowing crystal at the tip. Yes, it's for aiming. Old elven trick you wouldn't understand. Were you born on the surface, or are you from Orzammar? Orzammar. I got exiled. Stupid noble crap. Also, I accidentally blew up a bit of the shape rate. Rocky's one of our best sappers. He can take down enemy fortifications faster than a golem. I'm also working on my own version of Kunari Black Powder. I've almost got it. Yeah, you really don't. I take it you're the company healer. Yes, first time I ever picked up a sword was when the Blight hit Ferelden. Never put it back down. He makes a potion that'll put you right back on your feet after even the toughest fight. It tastes terrible, though. That's because it's a poultice, sir. You're not supposed to drink it. They can fight? We can fight, can't we, boys? No man can beat the Chargers, cause we'll hit you where it hurts. Unless you know a tavern with loose cards and looser skirts. For every bloody battlefield will gladly raise a cup. No matter what tomorrow holds, our horns be pointing up. Thanks for coming by, boss. Glad you could meet some of my team. Hey, good to... Ooh. Are you using a new soap or something? Got one of those scented bath things? Because I don't want this to sound weird, but you smell really good. Almost dragony. All right, that sounded weird. I've started training as a reaver. Part of the process involves drinking dragon blood. Ah, okay. That'd do it. I've heard about reavers. Brutally efficient. Get meaner the more they hurt. Hmm. Warriors after my own heart. I've noticed that your fighting style has a lot in common with a reaver. Are you... No. Guess I just stumbled on a similar style. I've always been good at reading people. Part of that is knowing how to make them flinch. They can hit me, they can hurt me, but they can't beat me. Is there any reason dragon blood smells good to you? Nothing I know of. Always had a thing for dragons, though. Most Kanari do. Maybe there's something tying us to them, deep in the blood. Or maybe it's just the dragons are really badass. You don't have any trouble with Reavers, then? Not with their fighting style, anyway. I care more about the why than the what. So, why'd you start drinking the blood? I made the decision. That's all you need to know. Sorry. 